Okay, so this is our fourth year to have the Fall Foods and Craft Festival. It's gotten bigger every year, and this year, I don't know what it is, but the weather, I think, and the DJ has just really taken this up a notch. And so we're having a lot of fun out here today. There's a lot of people on the street um, buying our clients goods that they make. And the music has just made all of our clients start dancing on the street. <laughs> so uh, it's really been fun so far. The clients look forward to this every year. I don't know if, they, if I look forward to it more or they do because it's kind of the kickoff to fall. And they, they work on items all year to get ready. I'm selling our, can, our canned goods. I also sold two paintings. It's good for us to get out and teach others. Let others get to know us and let, let us get to know them. You know, having a place that feels sort of happening and exciting, a place where people are gathering, it really encourages other people to enjoy it and visit. And uh, it just turns out to be a really great formula for a vibrant community. So it's a great event and supports a great endeavor. But it's also a really great uh, event for the community. It's a family friendly event where you can come out and see the, um, the crafts that our clients make. They have a lot to offer this community. And, um, and I think when people come out and see them and see what we're doing here and what we're trying to support in terms of employment and feeling a part of, a part of Little Rock and a part of Arkansas in terms of um, getting clients out and about more, I think people see the difference and they come back every year.